God says, it's like these magical boats have a GPS that's tuned into your heart's desires and life. They'll navigate the twists and turns of the river to reach you when the time is right. You might slow down, you might speed up, you might even stop for a while, but those boats will adjust their course to make sure they reach you at the perfect moment. On the other hand, there are other things that might seem really attractive or important. You might try really hard to catch these boats, running, jumping, and reaching out with all your might. But if they're not part of your true path, no matter how hard you chase them, they'll slip through your fingers. It's like they have a different destination in mind, a place where they belong. And no matter how much you struggle, they won't fit into your journey. So, when you're faced with choices and opportunities, remember this river of life and the boats floating upon it. Trust that the things meant for you have an incredible way of finding you, even if you're on the move. And if something doesn't come your way, no matter how hard you try, maybe it's a sign that it's not meant for you. It's not a part of your unique, beautiful journey that's unfolding just the way it's meant to be. Imagine you're learning to ride a bike for the first time. Your parent or guardian stands a little way off, watching you carefully as you pedal and waddle. You might start to feel a bit uncertain. What if you fall? What if you can't do it? But then, as you keep trying, you notice something interesting. They're not shouting instructions or running over to help every second. They're just standing there quietly, observing. God's silence can be a bit like that. It's not because he's angry or upset with you. Instead, it's a powerful signal of his unwavering confidence in your abilities. Just like your parent believes you can ride that bike, God knows you have the strength, wisdom, and courage to handle whatever challenges come your way. When things get quiet, it's like God is saying, you've got this. He's giving you the space to take the handlebars of your life and steer with your own choices and decisions. His silence is a sign of trust, a way of saying, I believe in you and I know you have what it takes to navigate through this journey. It's a bit like a test in school when the teacher stops giving instructions and lets you work independently. It's because they believe you've learned enough to handle the task on your own. God's silence is a testament to his faith in your growth and development. He's giving you the opportunity to apply the lessons you've learned to trust your instincts, and to discover the incredible strength you possess. So, the next time you feel like God is silent, remember that it's not a punishment. It's a sign of his immense trust and confidence in your abilities. Just as a quiet, watchful parent lets go of the back of your bike seat when they see you're ready, God's silence is a powerful declaration that he knows you're ready to ride the waves of life with courage, grace, and strength. Type yes if you believe in God. God bless you.